Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to some more Thrive, episode two with our series here. We had done a pretty good deal of upgrading last time, and we're going to keep messing with it this this time around. Um, I'd like to actually see if we can get some useful stuff uh, on our cell here, but we need to go. It's actually a good area to probably gather some more, some more stuff, right? You can see the organelles actually get added to our cell, which I think is really cool. It's a very neat look. I don't actually know what you need to do to win the game, but I have a general idea. Let's go ahead and add... Um, let's add some flagellums, I think, for movement. That'd be kind of cool. Like that? Nice, look at that. We move really fast now. Yeah, that, that was a good idea. The population is 120, so we are advancing and growing. I think those were a pretty good idea because now we move a lot faster. Just three of them. I wonder if we can start. Eventually, we're going to need to get certain things that allow us to eat a lot of these. Well, you're starting to see some more of... Our creatures floating around out there. Especially as the population goes up. Eventually you'll start seeing pretty much nothing but that. Oh, here we go. Let's go ahead and pick some of this up. Phosphate. I guess it wasn't really being turned into anything. You don't have the correct organelles to pick a lot of this stuff up. I didn't realize that when I was recording last time. You actually have to have certain organelles to be able to pick up certain things. That's why I wasn't picking up some of this stuff when I was going through it. All right, we're more phosphate. We need, yes, this here. Starting to see some of these cells around us actually advance a little bit. Ooh. They're not running to anybody that's significantly bigger than us. We might have a problem. That guy must move really quite, uh, fast with that. Oh, these guys are battling it down here. <gasps> we won. Nice. So we can actually start killing some of this stuff? Not really. Some of these cells are not as aggressive. Or they don't have means to defend themselves. Ooh, that actually hurt me, though. See, some of that stuff's not good for you. I'm definitely trying to avoid some of the bigger cells if I can. Oh, you know what? No, he just seems to take damage for some reason because he's he's going to go out here any second. Oh, that one actually went out too. Well, some of them seem to leave something behind when they do that. Okay, we need more glucose. Here we go. Oh, we're dead. We ran out of glucose and ATP. We didn't we didn't do enough good feeding. We needed to find uh something that was going to convert. Oh, you know what? I might have messed up a little bit. Yeah, I'm starting to see a lot of cells on, on their way out. That's not good. Hopefully we don't kill off our population. What did I add? Did I add anything that might have messed us up? Ooh, this is cool looking. Okay. Right, because you want to add certain things to your cell to actually make it live longer. I'm pretty sure that's a doge inside there. I could, I could be wrong, but I'm almost positive that's what's going on. 
Here we go. Lots of glucose. Got to eat lots of glucose to get that ATP. Then we can we can upgrade our editor in, in a way that we can make sure we maybe convert something to glucose, right? That might be handy. I think I saw a couple organelles that did that. There's a lot of food in this area. I actually realized the other area seemed like it was pretty scarce. I wasn't seeing too much. I kind of wish that that editor button up there in the top right hand corner blinked or something when it was available because I can't tell when I haven't I can access it. I'm assuming there's something that that you know that's kind of when you do it but I don't know what that threshold really is. There we go. A lot of people from my species here. Perfect. Yeah, so we lose glucose, and then when we lose glucose, we lose ATP, and that's the problem. I pick this stuff up, but I, I'm guessing that gets converted to ATP, too. I'm going to have to look at my organelles again. There we, Oh, it does, actually. I apologize. I... It does actually make a noise. It's just not as noticeable, but oh, we actually just randomly evolved without me even interfering. Okay, let's go ahead and jump into here. We need something. Let's see. Capture, use the cells, perform respiration. So it performs uh, glucose to ATP. I need performs process one glucose a second. So photosynthesis. So we're going to want two of these is what we're going to want. And I'm going to put them some place that makes sense yeah symmetry would be nice not like that though well i already lost symmetry because this can't go unless i could turn this can i turn this i that doesn't appear i'm playing with keys here it does oh 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 it does turn thank god i i wish i could see which one though now because right because i don't know where i put it but i'm gonna guess it's that Okay. Nice. So now we should just produce glucose. Ah, yes, we do. We produce glucose naturally. That's, that's going to make us um, a lot more of a predator. A lot slower, too. But we should be able to stay alive a lot longer now. Because we are naturally producing glucose, we shouldn't starve. There's a lot more... Ooh. A lot more glucose down here. We might actually get the editor pretty quickly again. Then I got to think about what I want to go with next. Maybe the shooting thing isn't as useful as I thought it was. Wow, there's a lot of food here, though. Oh, and look at all the different members of my species all hanging out. We're kind of becoming the dominant members a little bit. I'm starting to see a lot more of us. We've become sort of agile. We're doing some photosynthesis here. So we've got some glucose. Um, it still wouldn't hurt to get some other things. But this is good. Jump up here to this hydrogen. See if I pick some of this up. Oh, avoid those because we know they do damage. This is hydrogen, glue. Oh, so this consists of a lot of stuff. Ammonia, glucose, hydrogen sulfide, phosphates. A little bit of everything. Ah, crap. I didn't see that.
Luckily, our health will go up. Yeah, see, we've got extra... We seem to be growing because we've got extra flagellies or whatever. What, what are we hurting for now? Oh, our ATP. Really? I don't understand in particular what I did wrong on this one. We got plenty of glu glucose. Is it just not being converted fast enough? I'm clearly missing a few things here with my understanding of this. Well, population's gone down now a bit, but I guess I could play with this new creature here and see if I can figure something out. Maybe he just advanced to have too many. Because this guy's got an extra one too, but we had like, what, two extra or three extra? So maybe that's consuming more ATP. Yeah, because this guy's losing it pretty quickly too. I would say faster than he's getting it. Oh, this whole area is like really bad on food. Can I go back to the other area? Holy crap. Pretty sure I just picked something up, but I don't know what it was. Yikes. Okay. Not good. We're going to jump to the next one. Here we go. Population is 90, so it drops 10 every time you lose. Sometimes more. I've seen it drop more. See, that's not helping us at all. So we need something that converts glucose to ATP faster. I'm pretty sure I had some I know I know there is something that does that. Cause we're just losing ATP way faster. Oh, I'm an idiot. <laughs> the, f the more you move. Duh. If you stop moving, you stop spending it. Well, this is my first time playing the game, so I'm going to make a couple mistakes as I advance forward here. I'm like sitting there watching it go down as I pick up the glucose, and I'm like, boy, I'm doing something horribly wrong. Well, that's why. So if we actually get something that converts glucose directly to ATP, we can move a lot more, and then we don't have to do any sitting, sitting still. Or we got to gain more ATP. Okay. That makes sense, actually. So, learning as we go. Hydrogen. Holy crap. Okay. We're actually producing. And they produce, too, every now and again, some type of waste, I guess. This is glucose and ammonia. Let's pick up a bunch of ammonia and see what that does for us. I actually have a pretty large store of ATP. Okay, I'm going to grab this. Ooh, see, that cell's dying. Well, very odd, then. Why not just stop and gather more ATP if you're dying? Maybe they're dying for other reasons? I guess if your gluco glucose does run out, right? So ATP naturally just generates for me now because I... Do have photosynthesis, so I'm naturally just getting glucose no matter what. Now I'm naturally losing glucose. 
Oh, we've gotten significantly larger. Ah, see, ah, that explains it. Now we're losing ATP. Oh, but we can, we can edit ourselves. Okay, so what do we need next? A couple of things here we've got now. I can't get any of these, but I can get these. So sure, they convert the noxious soup containing hydrogen sulfide from hydromethyl veins into usable energy in the form of glucose. So it can, turns other things into glucose. Associated uh, vesicles used by various prokaryotes, performance photosynthesis. Okay, I don't know if I want that. One hydrogen sulfide to two glucose a second. Let's see. Uh, 0 0.2 glucose to 14 ATP. So we need more mit mitochondria is what we need. Let's definitely keep it symmetrical. I feel like that's the appeal going on here. Symmetrical. I don't know, more cytoplasm too. Nice, look at that. It's like a little sp spaceship. <laughs> look at that. Look at us. Cool, so now glucose being per, uh, turned into ATP. We've got a population again of 120, but we're advancing. We're getting a lot better. I might get something that makes us faster, but to get faster, we're going to need to get more uh, ability to generate ATP. We're not going to want to get too fast, but turning glucose into ATP seems to be working. We'll find out how much that backfires on us shortly all right but we'll go ahead and leave it off here since we were out of time so population 120 we're we haven't advanced too much we had some baby steps here going on because trying to learn some of the controls and such but we'll see where it takes us in the next episode i want to thank you all for joining me i do hope that you've enjoyed it look forward to seeing you next time <laughs>